Thanks a lot, Kurt, and uh, the new GTLD applicants, and ultimately the end users uh, owe a lot to you for uh, taking the time to preside over the uh, new GTLD uh, applicant guidebook floor over the years and to be patient with all the debate and uh, concerns. So thanks, Kurt. Uh, initially, I'd like to thank our sponsors. Uh, new Star, Affilius, Verisign, and Doc Green are all speaking here today. Uh, Watch It Too has provided this great interactive live streaming, and I'd like to discuss it more with anyone here later on. It has ways of presenting speakers remotely, as you'll see here today, with Jeffrey Hazlett, and also with Esther Dyson. Uh, Annalisa Roger from uh, Doc Green will be speaking on the audio bridge, as well as some others. I'd also like to thank Definition 6, uh, a great unified agency that I think would be a tremendous asset to a lot of the new TLDs coming out and those that exist now. And Jonathan Acarino and some others are here and I'd like to introduce you to them during the breaks of the program. Uh, really briefly, uh, Alan and I came up with the topic here today, Master of Your Domain. It largely deals with domain names, but we feel that it also deals with the new digital domain surrounding brands, the personal brand, interest groups, as well as um, pretty much the stakeholders that use the web that's interwoven in our business and daily lives. Uh, I find that whether or not these new TLDs add value is somewhat moot now because generally we need to find out what the opportunities and risks are rather than worrying about whether or not the process is going forward. Um, I do think there will be over a thousand applications and for my research I think brands are, are largely lagging in terms of protecting themselves in ways now. And I'd be happy to speak to them uh, with strategy on that. Being that we're running out of time here and I want to keep us on track, I'm just going to cut through and read a couple of quotes from one of uh, my idols, William J. Mitchell, uh, who I thought of his books, uh, particularly City of Bits and Etopia, when I lobbied during uh, four different ICANs from Cairo uh, through Seoul. And um, I just want to say that it's largely uh, relevant to the topic and the timing of the new GTLDs coming out, even though it was written in around 1997 to 2001. Pertaining to perhaps another topic, but using here, William J. Mitchell said, an invitation to design and construct the city of bits, capital of the 21st century, with this new element turning classical categories inside out and reconstruct the discourse in which architects have engaged from classical times until now, how shall we shape it? And in Utopia, he wrote, this vast grid is the new land beyond the horizon, the place that beckons the colonists, cowboys, con artists, and would-be conquerors of the 21st century, and there, those that would be king. And I think that's super relevant, and I hope that we see the cowboys and the conquerors come and use this new land to positive ways of innovation.